Oh, shit. Here we go again. Andrew Griffin, followed by Brian Romanowski. Good morning, Andrew Griffin, Manatee County. Um, I've got three things on here, but before I get started on those things, I just want to thank the commissioners that have taken their time out of their busy days to meet with me, speak to me, not only about your, uh, your items, but also about mine. I've still got a few of you that I'm still looking to meet with to discuss those things. Um, also, uh, for my Citizen Commons future agenda will be the squeaky wheel. I'd like my phones, please. Please and thank you, 30 minutes, it's not going to break the ears in this room to open it up to 10 callers. Uh, if it's used, it's used. If it's not, it's not. Um, there's one request that I do have, and I don't know who to go to. So there is a cut through, and I'm, I'm sure uh, Commissioner Van Austin Bridge knows exactly what I'm talking about, between 53rd and 57th, 3rd Avenue, right past the um, Wells Fargo. It's getting more busy through that little cut through to go from uh, State Road 70 over to 57th. There, there has been several times that I've gone around the corner and people have almost hit me head on there. And it's only like a 25 mile an hour or 30 mile an hour area. But what I thought is instead of ex expending a lot of money to it, maybe if we could just paint um, some yellow, like just on that curve um, to divide the street I think that that would be really beneficial. It's it's just more of a maintenance item as opposed to any kind of thing. I, I don't know what goes along with it, but it's just becoming a little bit dangerous. I don't ever come in here and talk to you guys about hazards and stuff like that, but there has been several incidences cutting through uh, that, that place where I'm on my side of the road, but the people coming around are not. So I thought that might be um, helpful. And then the last thing, I don't, you know, I've been kind of absent from here for a little bit, and I know, and I just want to thank you, um, Mr. Washington, for stepping up, but I also wanted to know what was going on with the county administrative position. Um, you know, we, before Dr. Scott Hopes, we were told we were going to have a national review. That national review has never come to fruition. Um, you know, I have, I, I don't know what's really going on here, and was just hoping that maybe somebody could kind of enlighten um, the residents about what's going on with our uh, county administrative position, if that's going to go permanent or if we're going to actually be looking for someone. Thank you, and God bless. Yes, ma'am. Thank you.